What's going on everybody? This is Greatest Ever here again and I'm coming at you with some very good information regarding Dean Ambrose NXT at 4 star. Now, as you can see here, I have my 3 star gold and I did some uh, I did some digging basically to see uh, what move I would get once I got him to a 4 star bronze. And let me just show you real quick. There you go. New move unlocked. Diving elbow drop. Deal 812 damage and force your opponent to skip their turn for one turn. Now think about that. Everyone has been trying to get Zombie Austin because he has a move that forces their op uh, forces the opponent to be stunned for two turns. So basically, this is the same move in a sense. You don't really have to go looking for Zombie Austin. Now you can actually enhance your Dean Ambrose from NXT. Because I'm pretty sure you have a Dean Ambrose. Everyone starts off with a Dean Ambrose. So uh, you you don't really have to go searching and waiting and spending money to get Zombie Austin if you don't have him yet. When you could just go right into your roster, level up dean ambrose and get him at a four star so you could use this move again you need him at a four star bronze in order to get this move so definitely definitely uh if you don't want to use zombie austin if you don't know wait to get zombie austin then definitely um uh enhance your dean ambrose from nxt he's very good actually um the way i'm using him i have him as green yellow green and that move is a blue move, so you, you know there's a lot of different possibilities to uh, get him going. You know, I mean, honestly, once I get him at a four star, I'm looking to just replace the uh, spike pile driver, and then just use that move to increase my yellow and greens ASAP. You know, so I'll be running him at a blue yellow green once I get him to that four star. But I'm really excited because I had another three star silver for so long. And I was just wondering what would happen if he got to a um, four star bronze, what kind of movie would get. And I'm really excited that I found this out because even though I already have um, a zombie Austin, I only I don't even have him leveled up, honestly. You know, as you can see, I have, I have a lot of superstars. But I only I only have him at a, at a two star silver, and even though I already have his uh, his stun move, uh, the undead stomp, I uh, I just haven't gotten around to leveling him up honestly, you know. So luckily, since I have Dean Ambrose, I could just get him up to the proper levels. As you can see, most of his moves are really uh, leveled up at max. And then not only that, I just need a few more of these elbows, elbow uh, pads, just to get him to uh, the next level. So I'm really excited about that. And uh, while I'm on the subject of leveling up, as you know, you know we are in a uh, month-long contest with the uh, SummerSlam event. And I want to actually touch on the SummerSlam Evolved Kickoff Talent Up. So if you're new to these type of contests and you're not sure whether or not you should really participate in the Kickoff Talent event because you see that the uh, rewards, what you need to get the rewards is kind of steep, let me tell you this right now, all right? You don't really have to spend a lot of coins. If I was you, which I did actually today when I was uh participating in this event i was enhancing whatever three star superstars i had whether it was a bron a three star bronze to a to a three star silver or so on and so forth i didn't evolve my two stars i didn't evolve my one stars i evolved all my three stars because as you can see here when you evolve a three star not you evolve. Yeah, when you evolve or enhance a three-star superstar, you get 10,000 points, right? And right when you do that, you automatically go from having two rewards gotten to... I mean, one award gotten to two rewards gotten. You know what I'm saying? So not only that, if you just keep going by tens, you, you actually get the rewards faster. 
You know what I'm saying? Now, don't get me wrong. You could definitely go ahead and, you know, push for those two stars. Um, but just know that you're only getting 800 points off of that. 800 compared to 10,000 is a pretty big difference. You know, and if you want to get these cool awards in the end, you definitely want to save up on your enhances for your three stars and up. You know, um, also, if you don't want to spend a lot of coin, if you want to use that coin to level up superstars, I totally get it. You know, do that. Um, but in order to enhance or evolve your three stars, you're going to need to you know, take out at least 75K to do that. So if you have a good, you know, two, three, four million coin in the bank, then definitely utilize it to, you know, get these kickoff talent up uh, rewards because they are worth it. Some of them are really worth it. Some of them not so much, you know, um, especially what they got going on with these diamonds, having to spend 5,000 just to, you know, get one token kind of sucks, but, you know, we do what we got to do, right? But um, definitely, definitely uh, check out the, uh, your superstars, man. Because like I said, my, my, uh, my videos are all about trying to show you what superstars are worth looking at once you get them to higher levels and four stars. Because at the end of the day, yes, you know, I've been playing this game for three years. And I actually just got uh, a few new superstars, which I'm very happy about. I finally got my Vespic band. As you can see, I finally got my Macho Man, um, Trickster. And, you know, that took a lot of work, you know. But at the end of the day, if you go to my four stars, you'll see that a lot of my higher level superstars are the ones that I started off with. Seth Rollins, Triple H, Roman Reigns, you know. Uh, even when you get to my three star gold, you see Booker T, Mark Henry. You know, uh, again, Dean Ambrose. Even I have a powerhouse, uh, Braun Strowman, you know. So you don't want to sleep on the guys that you start off with because who knows what kind of moves they got at four stars. They were the guys you started off with, and I feel like Scopely will definitely give them a really big um, move that will change the game at four star, you know. Um, but, yeah, definitely check them out and... You know, give me a like, give me a comment. Let me know what kind of superstars. Or let me know what superstars you think I should review next. And not even review, just showcase. You know, because I'm still playing this game as well. And I'm just trying to help out any other new players out there. You know, so let me know in the comments below. All right. Thanks, guys.